Today I'm going to show you how to see your competitors Google Ads without any tools, without having to pay anything at all, completely free. So let's say you go to Google, you make a search for, in this case I search for farmhouse furniture. Since I have a website that sells farmhouse decorations and farmhouse furniture, I want to see some of my competitors ads. So what you can do is search one of your targeted keywords and you're going to have some different advertisements come up. So let's say I want to see the ads for NathanJames.com. All you need to do, you're obviously going to see the advertisement right here, but all you need to do is click on the little three dots right here. And then when we scroll down, you're going to see advertiser. They're going to have the name of the advertiser, the location. And all you need to do is click this link right here. See more ads by this advertiser. That's going to open up a page and it's going to show all of the advertisements that they've ran in the last 30 days. So we're looking at the last 30 days right now. So you can see a bunch of the different advertisements here. Now let's come up to the top. What we can do first is you can click from any time. You could look at today, yesterday, last seven days, last 30 days. If you see any time that's looking at last 30 days. So what we can also do is adjust by country. So you can see if they're running ads in another country. So right now we have it set to shown in the United States. So if I come down here, I could just say, okay, let's see if they're running any ads in Bermuda. Okay, they're not running any, any ads in Bermuda, but you can look at different countries and see where your competitors are actually running their advertisements. I looked through a few for this advertiser. I didn't see any besides United States, but maybe they're running in other areas I didn't check. So we're looking at any time shown in the United States. Next, and this is the coolest part, is all formats. So we can look at the image ads that they're running. We scroll down, there's a total of seven image ads. We can get an idea of what their advertisements look like that are running right now. We can come up to the top here again. Instead of doing image, let's look at their text advertisements. And when we look at your text at the text advertisements, you get an idea of some of the keywords they're probably targeting. So best home office furniture, best ladder shelves of 2022. So I'm assuming that they're targeting the keyword ladder shelves, off home office furniture, headboards. They might be targeting specific types of headboards. This is a dynamic advertisement. So you're seeing some different types of advertisements that they're running. Now what we can also do is we can scroll up to the top here and look at video. So I like looking at video. This is maybe the most useful here because you can actually click on the advertisement and you can play the video advertisement that your competitor is running. So you can see here, we can see what their video advertisement looks like and have an idea of the types of ads that this advertiser, one of my competitors is running. So let's look at one more example really quick. Let's say I go to Google, I search email marketing platforms. And let's just say I want to see MailChimp's ads. So what you need to do is find an ad by MailChimp. So since I don't have any at the top here, you can scroll to the bottom and see if there's any. Sometimes what you can do is just literally go to Google, type in whatever brand you want to see their advertisements. If they're not running ads, this will obviously not be available. But since MailChimp is running Google ads, I can again click on the three dots here. We can do see more ads by this advertiser. And you can see they are running a ton of different advertisements. So someone like MailChimp may be running a ton of different ads. Smaller advertisers, I think it said they showed they were running 31 ads before. But we could see any time shown in different countries and all formats. So let's just look at MailChimp. Let's see if they're running video ads. Okay, so we could see some of their different video ads here. So you get an idea of some of the different ads that one of your competitors may be running. So some of these look pretty similar. It may just be different campaigns where they're running them. Let's look at our text ads. This can also give you an idea, again, of some, some of the keywords that they're probably targeting. So if we scroll down, okay, so we have sign up forms, templates, automations, website builder, survey tool, templates, build a website on your own, another dynamic advertisement. So you're seeing different types of advertisements here. Now you might see some repeat ads, so not a huge deal, but you'll get an idea of what your competitors are actually running as far as their advertisements. Some of the different selling points that they try to actually point out to people. Our email design tools make you look like a pro even if you're just starting out. Register domain, build your website, market your business all in one place. More than 100 templates and designs. So you're seeing a lot of different advertisements and you kind of get an idea of what your competitors are doing by looking at their advertisements. So if you have any questions about how to see your competitors ads in Google completely free, please leave them in the comment section. Thanks for watching my video today and make sure you subscribe to the Surfside PPC YouTube channel.